Stop! Gary! Court order for asset seizure. So they're taking my car? You went radio silent on me. Is that what this is about? My feelings for you were so intense that I got scared. Is that true? Buongiorno! That's my cousin. Gary, I swear to God, he's my cousin. Mm. He's my second cousin. There's something seriously wrong with you. I'm an Uber driver and I don't have a car. I'm gonna lose my house. You think I chose him? Look at this. Need a car? Date our son this summer and bring him out of his shell before college. In exchange, we'll give you a Buick Regal. Date is in quotes. Bet that means sex. My husband, the code breaker. We've just been so worried about our son. He's going to Princeton in the fall. Oh, I've heard of it. Yeah, we tried everything to bring him out of his shell. He doesn't come out of his room. He doesn't talk to girls. He doesn't drink. So when you say date him, do you mean date him or date him? Yes. Date him. Date him hard. Okay. I'll date his brains out. He volunteers at the animal shelter. Hi. Mind if I touch your wiener? What? Your dog. <coughs> How about I give you a ride home? Um, this isn't the way to my house. It's a shortcut. You're my hostage. What you got down there? Something for me? <laughs> Why? You tried kidnapping me! You're 19, grow up! This kid is undateable. Have a drink together. He'll have a Long Island iced tea. This is the worst iced tea I've ever had. Okay. Me, Dance party. I don't know what to do. I just know my mom would have wanted me to save the house. He's probably just nervous. Why don't you loosen him up? He can go skinny dipping. What about sharks? None here. Jellyfish? Not this season. It's really the lack of life, Parker. She's getting in here right now, okay? I'm just a bit of a romantic. He's actually really sweet. The best part about getting older is not having to care what people think. I'm an adult now. I can make my own decisions. That's good. You want to save her? Save her. Come on, you're getting out of here. You don't belong here. Don't Let's touch face. me. Get away from her. Stay. Ah. 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 Maddie, you can't outrun the cops. I can't lose my license. Oh, hey, Dan. Happy anniversary. Dan, my husband, he's an amazing dad. You almost ready to go to size 4S, huh? Are you so big? Look at the big muscles. I just wish our lives were... bigger. Really? At least let me put my kid down. Clean up on aisle six. Sorry about the mess. Hold on. Oh, hey, Bo. Hey, Dan. Don't hang up. I need no identities, I'm burned. Me, my wife, and three kids. Have you told them yet? I'll tell them when I'm on the road. Meet me in Vegas in three days. This is crazy. <laughs> Look at God, we're going to Vegas! Woo! Oh, yes. so pumped. Nothing brings the family together like a road trip. Oh, I stop. Collaborate and listen. I is back with, with a brand, brand new adventure. Something. Grab Please stop. Me tight. <laughs> Five hours on a plane or 33 hours in the car? Can someone unlock the car, please? Call in, everybody. I want him found. What was that? A little pothole. Maxie's been up the whole time, by the way. Wish that. Before I met your mom, I was a covert assassin. I escaped that life, and now they found us. <laughs> What the? Being your husband and their father? That's the real me. You're like James Bond in a minivan? I love that minivan. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I need to be that guy one last time for us. Look at you playing the family man. I'm not playing. This is my life. Hey. I'm kind of into spontaneous Dan. Wait, wait. <laughs> Go. Mwah! New record. Honey, maybe we should just call it a night. You go ahead. I gotta finish these centerpieces and rearrange the seating chart. Yes. Hello? Mom, now is not the time. I just wanna ask, is that genetics or is it like Pilates? We got you a gift. It's your something borrowed. Brings you good luck. Except for Uncle Greg, who ended up kept. 
meditated on that forklift, but that's not the knives fault. Ah. Oh, someone just left that in the bathroom. You invited your ex? Looks like he's leading a porn safari. Oops, he forgot to button his shirt all the way off. Is it time for dinner? You look so much better than the rest of us. I think the left boob is slightly lower than the right boob. Something doesn't feel right. Once did I wonder if I'd be walking handcuffed to the jungle with a life grenade. Oh, sir, sir, give me the grenade, sir. I got it, I got it. Oh, you got it. I got it. You got it. I got it. You got it. Okay. Are you dead? We're going to fix this. That dress is growing on me. I wanted something less traditional. Nobody with my family. Ah, Don't you let go! I can hear you being quiet, Mom. I, um, hope I didn't ice your game, man. No one my age says those words in that order. It's just hard to see my little man not being my little boy all the time. Yeah. You know, for years, I've been taking care of this little boy. Making sure he is loved. That he feels like he belongs wherever he wants to be. He wants to go out into the world and do great big things. Not bad, kid. And what I worry about most... I love you, Miles. ...is they won't look out for you like us. Miles! Wanna get out of here? Wherever you go from here, you have to promise to take care of that little boy for me. Make sure he never forgets where he came from. And he never doubts that he is loved. And he never lets anyone tell him that he doesn't belong there. You gotta promise, Miles. I promise. Who do you think you are? Really? We are supposed to be the good guys. We are. You to the royal wedding, a simple instruction. Don't cause an international incident. How's it going? You've done some pretty stupid things in your day, but this... Thanks for cake? Henry shoved me. An urge I currently share. What I need is some good old-fashioned damage control. The White House and the Palace are going to release a joint statement. You've got to be joking. You can hate Prince Henry all you want. My NDA is bigger than yours. I want you to know that. You're wearing lifts. You know that too, sweetheart. You better act like the sun shines out of his ass and you have a vitamin D deficiency. I think thought is what you might say to convince the world that we're actually friends. I love hanging out with this guy. These days are way too long. 
happy now not to see each other again. You're expected at my New Year's party. Don't forget me, love away, but I won't. Did I do something wrong? Do you ever wonder who you'd be if you were an anonymous person in the world? I have no idea what you're talking about. You're as thick as it gets. Of your majesty. It's your royal highness. Oh. Dear Alex, I miss you. Good morning. We are in a hotel crawling with reporters. If anyone sees you leave this hotel, I will Brexit your head from your body. Your royal highness. You need to figure out if you feel forever about him. Do you love him? What difference would it make if I did? I want someone to love. Prince Henry belongs to Britain. I need we can figure out a way to love each other on our own terms. It's like there's a rope attached to my chest and it keeps pulling me towards you. Hopefully we'll get through tonight without any more scandals. <laughs> the night is young, Ma. That's what I want! Do you know that feeling when you're doing exactly what you were put on the earth to do? The one where it's like everything inside you is moving together in harmony with the universe. No! Me neither. But, you know, one can hope, right? Wave to mommy, because she'll hate me even more than she already does if you don't. I seem to recall you saying that becoming a lawyer would only crush your soul. Yeah, it has. I'm running a business, and right now that business is getting a journalist in and out of Paldonia. No. It's a one-off. No, no, and no. Who's a journalist? I have resigned my position here. Not interested. 20 grand says you are. Welcome to Bologna. President Venega, so nice to meet you. We must take a selfie. Um. You approve? Ah, it's great. Vamos! Oh! Ow! What the hell just happened? Your one man's security detail happened. He's a hero. I'm with the president of a country in the middle of a coup. This is the scoop of a lifetime. You gotta be alive to have a scoop for a lifetime. We never should have come. Let's go. You can't just leave him. Run! Run! Ready to go, I don't know how to stop. When you start at the bottom, only way to go is up. I'm just doing my job. Did you help? I get up again, then I got to win. I get up again, then I got to win. What? Nothing. You still excited to cover a coup? Less and less, honestly. Ladies, Venegas. Ladies, Venegas. Go for Pandora. Hey, not the time for coaching, man. Oh, oh my God. Oh, color me impressed, Mr. Petit. Not Petit at all. Hey, head of the wedding? Of my sister? Yes, I am. So where's your fiance? Wait, is this him? Hey, I'm Ben. I was her hall pass on your break. Wow, you are a child. It's a pretty long flight. Do you want anything from the front of the boat? I'm all good on creatine and smelled like insecurity. Nothing small about me. What the? That's the jerk Poopy got with when she was on her break from Jonathan. I could never be with someone like him. This girl's a disaster. Oh. Oh. They're gonna ruin our wedding. Sorry. Hey. How's it going, stranger? What's going on over there? They dated, she crushed his heart. That man does not have a heart. No way. Honey, look who's here! Who is it? My ex, Jonathan. My parents have been trying to get us back together. He's like a son to us. Maybe we should just tell everyone we're together. What? It would solve that problem for me, and you clearly want Margaret. She sees her with me, she wants what she can't have. There's no way we can convince anyone we actually like each other. You know, I still think about that night we spent together. Shut up. No, I'm serious. No matter how it ended, it was still pretty amazing. <clears throat> Convincing enough? Let's do it. Honey, here he is. Oh, no, I'm with Ben. Okay, so is it like we just got together or we been sneaking around? Let's just be affectionate. Showtime. Permission to put my left hand on your right buttock. Granted, not a magic lamp. Hey, little guy. Oh, 
God damn it. We have to kick it up a notch. Nice touch. Nice trash. Oh no, no, it's gonna be hot. When are you ever gonna learn? Fuck it, it's fine. Titanic me. Are they watching? Are they doing Titanic? They're gone, show's over. Oh my god. Do you have a mole or something on your butt? No. What the? One might be in you. I'm good. It's probably a better way to check than what I did. It's a bad idea, right? What did we miss? What did we miss? Fuck it, it's fine. Uh, you, you guys must be new to town, right? New to town, but not new to the country. We just moved from California. Oh, we just wondered uh, if, if you wouldn't mind if your, your daughter played with our daughter. Audrey, say hi. You want to play Sly? Mm-hmm. Slides off limits to Ching Chong's. Fuck you! Do you want to be best friend? Look at me, look at me, look at me now. Yeah. Guess who's going back to the motherland? It's a big deal, going to your birth country. We used to talk about it all the time when we were little, remember? Grand adventure to find your birth mother. So proud of you. <laughs> my translator in Beijing. Audrey, I got you. <laughs> Kat lives there now. Your famous college roommate. You ready to lose to a celebrity? Oh! Deadeye is coming, by the way. Deadeye your cousin? Hey, Audrey. Oh, hi. Hey. Deadeye. Where did that come from? You know, I think I get it. I called the adoption agency and she lives in Haiching. OK, will you guys come with me? Fuck yes, bitch. I love a grand adventure. So nice to see an American. What do you do for work? Hmm? Hmm? It's the cops are doing a back check. Oh my god, you're a drug dealer? <laughs> you're a drug dealers now, bitches! What the fuck? Is it a condom? We can't get caught with drugs in China. We'll get jailed for life. Crazy, gotta go crazy. never come to China. People are always thinking that I have this perfect life. I don't belong anywhere. If you do not know where you come from, how do you know who you are? still find her. Our passports are in my suitcase that got stolen. You know who can bypass the airport security? K-pop stars. Everyone remember their names? Sassy. Cutie. Lisa. Lisa, too. I don't believe these girls are serious. Girls, show them. Um, <laughs> what are we supposed to show? You're a fan of Cardi B, right? Yeah. Is she here? There's some whores in this house. There's some whores in this did you get the coke bags out? Yeah, but only seven, and I think I put in eight. Just push, pull. I mean, twist it. It's not a puppet, it's my asshole. When our world is threatened, one team is ready to launch. <gasps> Did he say lunch? Uh, no, I said launch. Uh -huh. The meteor's heading straight for us! <gasps> It's giving off some kind of energy. I didn't do it. No way. This September. I think we've got superpowers. And that's why I wear a hard hat. I've got the power. I feel the need for super speed. I'm a wrecking ball. Surf shot. <laughs> Look at your paws. Great. Now the clumsy pup shoots fireballs out of his paws. A new breed of heroes. Superpowers are real. Hits the big screen. We're gonna need a new name for ourselves. How about the Paw Patrol? But more. But just a little bit extra. Yeesh. How about the Mighty Pup? <laughs> Those should be my superpowers. Coming in hot. I'm gonna take them one by one. Oh my goodness! I can talk! <laughs> I have so much to say! Give me that! It's showtime! Well, well, well! Homedinger! He looks different than I remember! <laughs> Alright, Bobby! Playtime's over! When you go up against one of us, you go up against all of us! Let's go! We're super. I'm never gonna get to sleep. Well, you're probably more tired than you. 
<laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, how y'all doing? For all y'all that don't know who I am, my name is Willie Gary. Willie Gary. Willie Gary. William Gary. Never heard of him. What's so special about this guy, anyway? Litigation is war. It's a battle. Bam! And I'm not talking about no bullshit either. I'm talking about some John Claude Van Damme ass-kicking shit. Truth is, I may have gotten myself into a lot of trouble. I've been your lawyer 30 years. We can find a way out of it. You've never sued anybody before in your whole life. This fellow tried to bully me out of business, and I don't think I should be expected to stand for it. Mr. Gary hasn't lost a case in over 12 years. You suggesting I hire this guy as one of my lawyers? Y'all come on in. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Gary. Let me introduce you to my call, Red. How do you feel about working with black folk? I suppose I am a little prejudiced. Mm. Did you meet my team? I'm Chris. Deshaun. Reggie Douglas. Gentlemen. He's suing us? He's suing us? We are a half a billion dollar corporation. So how much money y'all trying to get? Eight million. That ain't enough money. One hundred million dollars. <laughs> Who is this clown he's hired as a lawyer? You're a fighter, man. What made you want to do it? Because he tried to mess with the one thing that means the most to me in life, being able to leave something behind for my grandchildren. Let's play some music. Sun is shining, sky is blue. My name is Maine Downs. Graduated top of her class from Harvard Law School. Uh -huh. They had a nickname for her around the office. The Python. I wouldn't get too used to me being kind to you, Mr. Gary. Once we begin that trial, I want to destroy you. Can't you see that we're golden? We only have a snowball's chance in hell of winning this case. Just, just trust me, okay? I, I, I may have found something. What does it feel like to be some small-time nobody on the verge of bankruptcy? What if I don't win and I let all these people down? You have been trying to turn this into your own one-ring circus. I got my damn life on the line. I know that, Jerry. Did it ever bother you? Oh, the hypocrisy, the hypocrisy. You sit your ass down. I'm you your honor. Hey, 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 wait, wait. What's the matter? We can't split the pole. Can't split the pole, man. Come on, man. Dollar. I'd like to report a crime that hasn't happened yet. Have you seen the movie Back to the Future? Basically, I'm living that movie right now, which is how I know there's gonna be a murder tonight. <laughs> Hate time travel movies. They never make any sense. Happy Halloween. How about we all stay in and hand out Halloween candy? No, Mom. You know how hard this time of year is for us. Your friends were murdered 35 years ago. It's not 1987 anymore. Stay safe, honey. I love you. <sighs> Year is it? 1987. Oh my god. I know. The 80s are almost over and I haven't even tried Coke yet. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my god. Mom. Fuck off and die. Oh, Jesus, Mom. Masita. Ay. Ay, ay, ay. Mamacita. You have time for my birthday, bitch. <laughs> creepy ass cabin in the middle of fucking nowhere. What's the big deal? There is a murderer on the loose and you drove us into the woods. Ah! Oh my God! What? I forgot to bring vodka. Go, 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 yeah. You have seven and a half hours until you're stuck here forever. Ah! I need to stop all this horror before it happens. Ah! Did the machines kill us all? No. They more just rip apart the fabric of our society via dance videos on TikTok. They used dance against us? Come on out, water's warm. Just so you know, I don't do blowjobs. You pee out of that thing. I think maybe if she did do blowjobs, she'd still be alive. Yeah, let's not make that the lesson. 80s weed sucks. This is just dirt. Look at all these twigs. Yeah, I could give you a gummy this big that has 100 times more weed than this. the 
residents of Element City. Air usually has their head in the clouds. Oh, my new jacket. Earth can be a little seedy. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing weird going on here. Uh, just a little pruning. Water is always getting into something. Oh. 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 Help! And fire? As ordered, we run a little hot. This shop is dream of our family. Someday it'll all be yours. But we all live by one simple rule. Elements cannot mix. Ah! The pipe squished me all out of shape. Dang. That's better. Oh. So you've never left Firetown? Sorry, buddy. Elements don't mix. Whoa! Plus, my dad would boil you alive. Why does anyone get to tell you what you can do in your life? Come on! Why do they even have these? Eh, who knows. Watch this! Whoa! Ember, I see a change in you. What hair guy? You live here? It's my mom's place. We got two kids that are swimming around here somewhere. I've been trying to fill my father's shoes, but I never once asked what I wanted to do. Try this! Dad, those are too hot. I love hot food. You see? He likes it! <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you, I've never seen anything like it. Holy. <laughs> is the craziest I think I've ever seen. Everything okay? $11 million? What are you gonna do? Get a Ferrari? What the? Oh, language. The baby's here. Ooh. Yo, what up, everybody? Roy and Kitty here. I'm gonna pick a stock and talk about why I think it's interesting, and that stock is GameStop. I love this guy. Retail traders have hooked into GameStop. I think they think it's a good investment. It looks like there's one guy driving all the buying. Who is this schmuck? Dumb money, man. Happy to take it. Wall Street is betting that this company is going to fail. But if it fails, these hedge fund people make a ton of money. 70,000 people have watched this video. Lord, Jenny, I love you! If he's in, I'm in. If he's in, I'm in. GameStop, those shares not stopping. Those stock is only gonna go up. When they hit, I'm gonna buy you a mansion. Let's drink to that. My brother is a nerd. Wall Street must be seeing this, right? You should probably dial in. Holy shit. Do you have a minute? I, uh, um. Babe, how much did we make today? Five million. How much did we lose today? A billion. And yesterday? Four million. And yesterday? A billion. Payment. Yeah. We're like really rich. You got rich dudes pissing in their pants right now. They're coming after you. We need to talk about the GameStop situation. Retail traders always lose. <laughs> You've been served. Wall Street cheated. Surprise, surprise. You have to testify before Congress. The game has changed. If it's us versus them, who you think gonna win? I'm going to win the race if you let some idiot steal the prize. A lot of people feel the system is broken. The whole idea of the stock market is if you're smart and maybe with a little luck you can make your fortune. Certainly not anymore. There's no hope for the little guy. Shit balls. Maybe now there is. Yeah. Pressure's all right, Gary. It's perfect. Is there any area in particular you want me to focus on today? Um, Gary, how many guys have you done this with? You're the first guy that I've ever been intimate with. I had a wife. She left. 
I really don't know what to say. I mean, words of affirmation is not my love language. It's more like... I've been alive for nearly half a century and I haven't actually lived even a second of it. Gary, I'm gonna help you. Let's find someone for you. Oh my God, there's so many hot guys. I think that this might just be too much. It's too late, he's already on his way. Wait, what? Hello. What's up, bro? Just wanna get in and get out. Oh, you can get in all right. It's a gorgeous landing. What are you doing? Oh, I'm calling 911. Gary, no accidents happen. It was your first night being gay. Did you really think you were gonna make it even stage? Fuck, you bled through the tarp. That's Mountain Ashwood. It's really porous. Oh my God, you're so gay. Oh. Are you a cop? No. Wait, are you? No. Good, because the dark web's built on trust. Come on! Is this what it's like? This is what it's like. I am like human paupers. I open anyone up. I'm really glad I met you. Even if multiple people are dead because of it. Dripping in diamond, a thousand eyes. Watching silence as we get high. Church girls know how to kneel. Where'd you kill him? Oh, we oh, right outside. You moved the body? Uh, we just tried. in the closet. You guys ever seen Gone Girl? Just, just a part with Ben Affleck's dick. Gary. It's known as the beautiful game, but let's face it, it's a complicated game, guys. Soccer, as you like to call it, is like life. Next season, I think we have a real shot. I'm sorry, uh, Thomas, did nobody tell you? You're... You're fired. Good news is, you got two options. Option one, that's where you're currently at. Or, American Samoa. Are you serious? If you're all alone, with the birds and the else free, take a on me. We haven't scored one goal in the history of our country trying to have a soccer team. Goal! They scored again. Humiliation. Mark my words, things are going to change. I got us a new coach. Oh. Something to drink? Whiskey, beer, wine? Yep, we got all those. Which one? Whiskey, beer, and wine. It's safe to say you have zero talent or understanding of the game. Something not right about this guy. Well, he is white. Coach, you've got the toughest job on the island. What we want is just one goal. One goal. Come on, guys! We've worked too long and hard for this. You've only been here a few days. What the? I can't work with these guys. For them, it's like some sort of game. It is a game, Thomas. That's it, Jaya, leadership. Now we're making some progress. Dear Lord, well, thank you for sending us Mr. Rongan. We've become quite attached to him. It's like finding a little lost white kid at the mall and telling him which way to go. I told you, I'm on vacation. While I'm on vacation, I'ma just float. Come here, Mr. Parker. Sure. Mm, yeah. Marcus and Emily Parker, you have failed to notify your airline that you are registered sex offenders. What? <laughs> mm, what the hell is wrong with you? Look at us, all together again. We just wanted to give you guys a real honeymoon. Just found this crawling under a table. He's, He's crawling? crawling? It's yes. your first time? It's a prodigy, it's amazing. <laughs> What are they doing letting us in a place this nice? How the hell did you get us in here? You didn't tell them. They gonna be long gone by the time I get into my work thing. You must be Mr. Parker. Apologies for the change in schedule. Mr. Young has invited you for drinks. All of you. Guys, I need you to be really cool. Can you do that for me? Could you? When have we ever not been cool? Dad! Literally just released from St. Quentin. <laughs> I got you the best wedding present. Fire. What? Why 
Why does this Coke not taste cokey? Because it's your mom. I just look at your mom. It's really kind of beautiful if you think about it. No! This is not how I picture things going at all. It's cool, Marcus. It's cool. We float, right? We float. We float. I'm just shooting at us! Ah! Let me down! Get your hands off my wife! Ever since he showed up, he turned this relaxing family vacation into total chaos. Who does that? We have been through hell. Why don't we just go back? I knew it. Chicken. It's only one thing left to do, sir. Oh. I've never seen that much water come off a person before. Did I throw up a lot? Your butthole threw up, bud. Oh. I've been having the strangest dreams. Rachel, dreams are not reliable analytical material. That's so 20th century. Hi, Rachel. We're delighted to let you know that we've had movement on our wait list. We got a spot at the Wim Center. Oh, my God. <laughs> but I haven't told Elvie yet. Oh, oh, why, Rachel? He wants a natural child. But hold on, you put us on a wait list to have a baby and an egg. No, it's not an egg. It's, it's an egg. Women are reluctant to have children because it's not made convenient. We want them to pursue their careers and dreams. We can't live in the past. I want to have a child with you. Let's do it, Rachel. Really? Yeah. I'm sure you're all very excited. Parents are raving about it. It is the ultra solution. <laughs> My nephew was born at the womb center, but he doesn't dream. I wouldn't worry about it. Oh, I, can't, I can't do it with a pot in here. What are you talking about? I can't see us. I feel Alvi is able to bond with our child, but I'm not. Maybe I'm just not ready to be a mother. You know, no one's a mother just like that. You become one. Lately, I've been holding on to something. We are considering having a home birth. I'm sorry, it's not possible. I won't raise this child without nature. Congratulations. It's so exciting, isn't it? I noticed a change in productivity. You do have a baby at the womb center, right? Why? What's that? Things are revolting. Your family dynamics are about to undergo tremendous changes. How can we make sure our baby's not bored in utero? Oh yeah, we don't want any bored babies. Yes? Hi, I have some bad news. We lost your mom. What? Sorry, that was terrible phrasing. I meant we don't know where she is. Oh, I think your sister's here. Annie, it's finally happened. Oh my God, it's okay, it's okay, I'm here. We're all, oh my God, you're working Annie. Oh She's not God. dead. She ran away. Tough bitch. And yum. Your mom owes me 80 grand. When you have it, you'll get your dog back. Mm -hmm. I don't have any money. You can sell your eggs. Well, it's not like you're using them. No, there has to be another way. What is the square root of 196? 14. Correct. How many hearts does an octopus have? Three. Correct. What? Saffron. Saturn. Aphrodite. Apollo. Aries. Carbon dioxide. The equal sign. Correct. Oh my god. What? You know this game. This is how you're gonna make the money. I'm taking you to the quiz. Look out! Learn how to drive. Racist! Oh. Hi. Come on, it's gonna be fun. I'm not sleeping on the floor. I'm not sleeping on the floor either. I sleep on the chair. I don't want to sleep in a sitting position. Oh my God. Hold up. Hold up. Catch another fight. I can't play on live TV in front of millions of people. Once you get to it, I know you got to get through hair and makeup. I already went through hair and makeup. Well, and you missed the spot. Ladies get money. I can't do this. Am I sweating? Yeah. You know what? Put your arms down. You're having a panic attack. Doctors prescribe these. Is that cocaine? <laughs> Oh, stevia. Do you, do you ever use stevia, the sweetener? Yeah, yeah, I've got it in my pocket. Win or lose, we'll do it together. 
that is definitely broken. I bet you I could pop it back in my sound. Right, no, no, I can't. Wait, 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 wait. I'm going to throw okay. up. How can I ever thank you? Maybe like a drink later? Well, I'm married. And gay. Why'd you have to say two reasons? Hey, Doc. Mm -hmm. I was thinking tonight could be a good night for sex night, possibly. Ooh. It's an interesting idea, but, you know, Thursdays. Stephen Laudem, how's the new opera coming along? Good, great, yes. great. We had discussed seeing a first draft of the score in two weeks. Two weeks. Is that still all right? I'm suffering from a temporary blockage at the moment. No, turn it back on. One. G flat. Is he all right? He had a total breakdown after his last opera. Uh -huh. I can't do this. We need to take a walk. Jolt your brain out of its little rat pattern. Interact with a stranger. Okay, honey, I have a patient. Bye. Are we going that way? I keep imagining you naked. I don't know if you want to hear more details about these images. No. I bet every one of these people has a story for an opera in them, Levi. What do you do? I operate a tugboat. The wrong hands, this tug is a deadly weapon. I'm addicted to romance. Isn't everybody? I've been arrested for stalking. I had to go to rehab. And uh, I'm not supposed to be doing this. Can't believe that actually happened. I mean, she seduced me, right? She's a witch. The demented tugboat captain who lures men to her tugboat and kills them and eats them. I loved it. How did you come up with that? I was really angry at you. And now it turns out I'm your muse. Do what? Oh, Steve, I'll never leave you. Um. I love cleaning. Cleanliness is close to cleanliness. When my patients are talking, I imagine getting inside their heads with disinfectant and just scrubbing them down. Your tugboat captain came to see me. I'm in love. No, no! Just admit that I had a magic effect on you. My imagination came up with the story. My talent wrote the music. I mean, you don't kill men and eat them, do you? <laughs> well, I haven't yet. You know I can't resist a romantic story, even if I'm not in it. Everybody listen, this is important. I'm gonna show you guys something, and when I show you what I'm gonna show you, don't freak out. I can explain. beginning to look a lot like Christmas. High stakes as neighbors compete for best decorated house on the block. I think this is the house to beat. Wow. What's your Christmas wish? I just want to win this thing. I'll take it. Signature, please. Ignore all the fine print. It's like you're signing your life away. Merry Christmas. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Oh, it will be. Rise and shine, naughty boy. <laughs> what the hell is all of this? Something's happening. Good morning, sir. Are you real? We all were until we fell into that elf sick trap. You made your wish. You're in it now. I didn't sign on for this. You literally signed on for this. You gotta read the fine print, man. The terms of service are brutal. <laughs> Say goodbye to your dad. Why are y'all just like Prince? We are not gonna let her turn your dad into one of those weird Happy Meal toys. No offense, I'm sorry. None taken. A little taken. We are the Carvers. We gotta catch an elf. You met with the wrong family. We should split up. What do you mean we should split up? Have you never watched a horror film? If you split up, somebody dies. Have you ever died? Oh. It is not fun. That's true. I'd never died, but mom knows. I didn't know you'd die before. Let's go find these rings. Is that who I think it is? Oh my God, Black Santa! New Santa with Black, man! That was class. Sorry, that was my fault. Are you okay? You just had Zach McLaren's ball in your face. Mm, what's his GPA? 
Do you have any books on Battletoads? You know video games are now the leading cause of divorce. Could you actually order me a book on that? Really? No. Sarcasm is frequently an attempt to deflect one's ignorance. So is it being a know-it-all. Oh, wait, you forgot your credit card. Hey! Oh. oh my God. What's up? The heck get a car. Now he's a concussion and he thinks that I'm his girlfriend. Thank God it's you. Oh, oh, <laughs> already. He is dating Zoe. What other Zoe? He's either dead or he's dumped me. Honestly, I'm not sure which is worse. Make sure Zach takes it easy. His symptoms could get worse. What do I do? You don't want him getting worse. Pretend to be the other Zoe. You've been dating two or three weeks now, right? Yeah. This is Zach's cousin, Miles. He's in grad school at MIT. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. A match for Zoe. I caused the accident, and now I'm going to flirt with an amnesia patient's cousin? We're all going to go skiing in the mountains this weekend. You want to go with us? Strip of land, seven letters. Mm, it's my Oh, how did you know that? Well done, you two. Should we hit the slopes? Yeah, we shall. Ah! Oh! It's confusing. I'm enjoying getting to know you. Over again. Go take a swing at life. You and Zach, do you really think you're a good match? Like we are. <laughs> it's complicated. <laughs> I need to tell him the truth. You have to go after what you want and be brave. Oh my god, you're just giving me rom com advice now. No, it's so fun. So, what did you do? Did you have fun? What didn't we do? Excuse me? All PG-13. Okay. Do you know what the greatest thing about America is? You can make things happen here like nowhere else. You have the power to create your own future. You can be anything. You can do anything. You want to sell high-end stuffed Himalayan cats. Understuffed, actually, for greater posability. We're professionals. We're giving the people what they need. Did you see the latest numbers? We broke the entire internet thing. You go big, or you go home. Ty would tell you he did it all. Which is as crazy as believing stuffed animals are gold. Do you see the truck crash? Insane. <laughs> Poor beanies. This has always been my company. Company we created together. Why do you have to be so dramatic? I mean, my salary's been reduced 75%. Yeah, I'm just doing what's necessary. You know, running the real actual business over here. My life is this company. I see where it's going. There are signs of real trouble. Genius is 1% inspiration, 99% presentation. That's not how the saying goes. <sighs> Everything good that's happened to me is because of you guys. We are bonded forever. Have you considered poisoning him? Countless times. <laughs> have our perfect partners lined up. Jehovah's Witnesses, the greatest one-on-one -on -one salesman in the world. How brilliant is that? <sighs> I'm gonna go. You're dead to me! I only want to speak to Oprah Winfrey. Has she reached out? You'd let that dog kiss on my walkway. He has no idea who's doing that. Well, it was one of you. Hey, Otto! No. Don't you dare let that little rat dog kiss on my walkway again. Ignore him, Prince. He has no idea who's doing that. Well, it was one of you. You cannot use this road without a permit. Have a nice day, sir. You know, the other guys don't do this. The guys with the white trucks. How come it's always you brown guys? And I don't mean that racially. Oh, I'm sorry you didn't get me here earlier. The whole neighborhood is falling apart these days. Don't go that way, 
otro no. lado. No, 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 stop. Oh, my God. Give me the keys. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Otto. Otto? O-T-T-O. I'm Abby. O-T-T-O. <laughs> Got some new neighbors. Bye. Edward husband. I brought you some food. Okay. okay. Bye. Are you always this unfriendly? I am not unfriendly. Okay, you're not. Every word you say is like a warm cuddle. Can you please give me a ride? I don't have a license. You don't have a driver's license? How old are you? Punch in and break. Break. The car is stopped. Ah! Don't hit the car. Break. Break. I almost hit the car. It's all right. It's a hybrid. Well, it's all right. How did you get in here? No, no, no. You are not taking over my bed. I was wondering if you could help us out. I'm not sure about this. It's going to be very fun. How was it? You did a good job. You should pat yourself on the back. Well, it's all right. right I have a cat. You have to do everything on your own. But guess what? No one can. I'm Beppo! You want to see a trick? Yeah! Could I borrow a coin? What did you do? Send me back to the corner! No, sir, no. It was all the clown's fault. How did you come to write this book? What really struck me was that too few books were about my people. Where are our stories? Where's our representation? Would you give us the pleasure of reading an excerpt? Yo, Sharonda, girl, you be pregnant again? If I is, Ray Ray is gonna be a real father this time around. Thank you. Monk, your books are good, but they're not popular. Editors, they want a black book. They have a black book. I'm black, and it's my book. You know what I mean. Look at what they published. Look at what they expect us to write. I just want to rub their noses in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be standing outside in the night. There'd be dads, rappers, crack. You said you wanted black stuff. That's black, right? I see what you're doing. We sold a book. No. We believe Mr. Lee has written a bestseller. It's a joke. The most lucrative joke you've ever told. Now, is Stag a pseudonym? Yeah. Mr. Lee can't use his real name. Is this based on your actual life? Yeah, you think some bitch-ass college boy can come up with that shit? No, no. No, I don't. Can I ask what you were in for? Was it murder? Yeah, you said that, not me. They ran 300,000 copies. Your books changed people's lives. They're offering $4 million for the movie rights. Yes! The dumber I behave, the richer I get. This has gone too far. Stag Arley is still on the run for authorities. You haven't done anything. It's not like they can arrest you. Wish I could go back to not selling books. Is it bad to cater to people's tastes? People want to love you, Monk. You should let them love all of you. There's already so much buzz because of the movie deal. Michael B. Jordan is circling. We want to put him on the cover in one of those um, uh, scarves, I guess you would call them, tied around his head. A do-rag? Do-rag, that's it. Do-rag and a tank top with the muscles showing. Oh, something called the fire department. <laughs> We're thinking we can get it out in hydrogen tank. You know, you really captured his essence. Maybe his face could use a little more detail, though. It's like a photograph. I'm Adam. Chloe. One, two, three. Sure you're not gonna make fun of me? Just like, you show me. <sighs> All right. Oh my God. This might be the nicest thing anyone's ever done for me. You have 62 viewers and $300 total. They don't have love in their culture. They find romantic stuff super exotic and interesting. They say they watch you go on dates. 
Family dinner is one of our most cherished human rituals. Do you have to do this right now, Chloe? You're not supposed to talk about the broadcast on the broadcast. Floating in space. Hey, would you keep that shit out of my line of sight? Why don't you keep your shit out of our line of sight? You didn't invent courtship broadcast, bitch. It has recently become obvious you are deceiving your viewers. What? Deceiving? The title of your broadcast is Adam and Chloe in Love. And yet you are not in love. I want you to repay all funds you have received. Wait. We've already spent everything we made just to live. Then I will take you to court and your families will be in debt for approximately six generations. Do you want me to cut that for you? Where is the nearest restaurant? No part of my body can make that noise. It's it Well, it, it certainly won't if you don't try. We can get that love back. Romantic love is the most poetic of all human love modes. It should never be faked. I'm just like any other person. I want to grow up and fall in love and be swept off my feet. We've lost a lot since you guys came here. But we've overcome a lot, too.